All right, today we're checking out Candlebox. We'll listen to the song Far Behind. Let's get into it. Now maybe I did not mean to treat you bad, yeah, but I did. Okay, this song is like if Eddie Vedder, Pearl Jam, and Kid Rock were combined. Really? The I voice, so. the sound of the voice, I just feel like it has a little grunginess, but then it, it's like very grunge, and then it like, you know what I mean? It's like, okay, I agree. I agree with that. Definitely has a little grunginess to it. Right? Right? It's like grunge, but then it like it's like country. Or like not, not like country sounding, uh, but like, you know what I mean? But like the intonation, like how he, how he says some of the words... Is that what's country? I don't know. I don't it's know not, not, country, not country, country music. Oh, not, not country, country music. music. Like Kid Rock Country. Just like a person who lives in a country. Like Kid Rock Country. Kid Rock Country. Kid Rock's country? No, but like he's like he's like a country person. You know what I'm saying? Yes, it's then to grow up in a city. Yes. Oh, right. okay. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. yeah.
Okay. Can someone please explain what the song is about? Well, like, who is he talking to? He's talking to, like, um, girlfriend, ex-girlfriend type thing? That's what it seems like. That's what I was thinking. Was it mentioned he in there? Did I miss it? I don't know. And talking about, like, her friends, the people around her. And it was a her, and for sure? That's that's my interpretation. Right, that's the thing. I was like, well, I don't remember specifically what, like, if he said anything about it. But, yeah, like, was it, were they friends that grew apart, or was this a girlfriend, ex? That, that was my question. So it seemed like an ex. How'd you like the song? To me, it sound, it was like it was like Eddie Vedder from Pearl Jam, but it was like he uh, he did some time in jail or something. You know what I mean? Um, like you think it's harder than Eddie Vedder from Pearl Jam? It was just a little bit more like ah. Like a person mean? who's been through harder like times. Eddie's always like, like rawr, 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 rawr. and then this was a little bit more rawr, rawr. like it was like <laughs> it's like a little bit like he had a little bit rougher of a life than Eddie. Okay. You know what I'm saying? It was like Eddie's, like, you know, Eddie's cousin that grew up, like, in the other side. Eddie's jailbird cousin. Yeah, Eddie's jailbird cousin. You know what I'm saying? He was a little bit like he was going through some things. It's a little uncomfortable. But that adds. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it definitely makes it different. You know what I'm saying? It adds some character to the vocals. If I wanted to hear right. Pearl Jam, I would listen to Pearl Jam. You know what I mean? So it's like <laughs> Eddie's cousin. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. For a different vibe. It definitely does add to the way he was expressing himself, you know, even the way he's enunciating the words. It was pretty interesting. Like, instead of just saying sad or, you know, bad, he was, bye, yeah, Even maybe he was, bye, yeah. He was going through some things. Yeah. I don't know. Tell me, man, what do you know? What do you know? Me and my boys on the road. Where did it go? Me, boy, you go. Like, I don't know, but I don't.